guys me rage you're back with a new video and today we're going to take a look at dragon's dogma i normally don't review too much games because uh well i love wow i'm looking for pantheon um to come out at some point uh in the meanwhile i bought some games and one of those is dragon's dogma now the thing is um i never heard of that game before i had no clue it existed and uh, there was a youtube video i watched from a youtuber and he was actually talking about this game and he got uh, so many positive reviews that i was maybe it's worth to take it look take a look so i bought it and i i'm currently playing it i'm like three hours in i'm completely overwhelmed because uh solo rpgs well, are really hard for me i don't know because if i don't have a clear path everything is very complicated the new interfaces new new stuff you can do and i thought i want to show you guys what this game is about like just a bit a look into it so we're going to start a new game but just real quick so i want to show you guys what this game is all about now this game is a, has a very 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 special okay i cannot make a new game so we're gonna just load my old one or the one i'm currently playing now this game has some very special things and it's very very cool so the special thing about this rpg is this solo rpg is that you have pawns now Take a look at my character right now, and um, you can see behind me is my pawn. This is the closest pawn to me, um, which will level with me. And then you have two extra pawns, which are like just NPCs that work with you, but they are special. They are they are they are their own classes, and you can recruit new ones um, that go and uh, fight with you along the way. Now. Um, First, I want to take a look at the graphics real quick. A lot of people say that this game has bad graphics. Um, maybe it's because I'm old school, but I actually love this kind of graphics. I love the way this game looks. And for me, I would love an MMORPG that would look like this game does. Simple, very simple interface. And the graphics are exactly the ones that I like. Um, maybe I'm really old school when it comes to that. But I don't think that graphics are the most important thing in an MMORPG. Of course, you should have like kind of a standard today. But I love the way this game looks. Maybe it's really just me. I love this city. Look at this, how beautiful it looks. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm currently having a lot of fun at this game. I'm currently streaming it as well. I have a lot of people who luckily tell me what to do. Because I'm very, very retarded when it comes to RPG games. Um, because there's not really a, a way that you have to follow but people tell me a lot of stuff and i just love it i'm here in the in the first main city um the special thing about this game is you pick a class at the start but you can change your class throughout the game so um i just decided i was a fighter at the start and now i i decided to be a warrior um which i currently am you have like skills like your left click and your right click very simple and then you have like um and your primary skills which you can change you can bind your 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 attacks to whatever key you want here um i have the upward strike where you kind of dash into the enemy and then throw him like into the air it's it looks absolutely crazy um then i have like the pummel strike which just pummels with the back of a sword um and then you have like secondary skills which i don't have on my warrior but you would have on different classes and there are very very different classes in this game um i have just tested the warrior like I said, I'm completely new to the game right now. I just wanted to give you guys some insight and uh, just show you guys how, how much fun I actually have in the game. Now, this game has some very special mechanics. Stuff that completely blowed my mind at the start of the game. And this was... Now, imagine a boss fight or, or just a completely normal game and you have a boss there. In this game, you can climb the boss. You can actually jump on the boss climb to his head and kind of attack him while you're sitting on this boss this is absolutely nuts and i was so overwhelmed by it but i never because i never really saw that you know uh most games are just about the boss fight you are on the ground you're hitting it you can dodge you can do stuff like this but you can actually climb beasts and this is absolutely cool now here i want to show you um the classes real quick change vocation so if i just wanted to change my class i could do that whenever now, these are the classes Warrior, Ranger, you can pick a Sorcerer, which is your usual mage, you have Mystic Knight, I have no clue what that is, probably like a Sorcerer, 
sorcerer and uh, uh, a warrior or something. Um, then you have the assassin, which is really cool too. I did not play it because he has a bow. And I was thinking maybe... Uh, I, I have no clue how it, how it plays, so I'm just saying, like... You can play an assassin, you can play a magic archer, like a uh, strider, uh, here on the top, strider, a mage, wait, what is the difference between a mage and a sorcerer? Like I said, I'm very new to this game, and I'm just overwhelmed by this, I'm having a blast, and it is a solo RPG. Um, they actually made a MMORPG out of this game, but sadly it's just available in Japan, which is very, very unfortunate, because like I said, if this would be an MMORPG, you can make sure that I would be playing it because I'm having a blast and normally I don't play solo um, MMORPGs just because in my opinion they are boring I'm sorry if I offend anyone but I cannot lose myself in an NPC world but for some reason I can here which is weird but like I said I really like the combat I love the graphics might for some of you guys it, it seems very simple but that's what I like. I don't know why. Maybe really because I'm old school. I just said that before. But look at the graphics. Look at this medieval view. Look at the sun. It, it, it doesn't look bad. I mean, you can see it's older. But it's not like it is bad, right? I. It just blows my mind. Because I would love to see an MMORPG like this. With those graphics. This seems like just what I want. I'm not even kidding. And uh, I'm having a blast. I'm, I keep playing it. You can visit me on Twitch if you want to. I, I, I be streaming it every time I play it. Uh, and I'm very confused because a lot of people tell me where to go, what to do. And y you're just kind of lost in this world, you know. Um, I just want to show you some fights real quick. Now, I'm a warrior. I'm a I just changed really recently. So I have very slow attacks. I'm a very, very slow fighter. But like I said, there are so many classes in the game that it is uh, very easy for anyone to find his class. Now, I can... I can say go to my pawns and they start attacking it. They're like my NPCs, but they buff me. You can see they buff me a fiery sword right now, which is really cool. So my sword is burning right now. Um, I show you here some. Oh, actually, they're almost doing it by themselves. Now this is just my normal click here. This is just a normal left click. Normal left click, very simple. You can sprint, uh, but need to watch out that you're not exhausted too much. Um, then I have my prim primary skills here, which is the upward slash here. Oh, I missed. No, I actually hit him. Fucking throw it into the air. Do you see that? It looks absolutely amazing. I'm having a blast. Um, you have a pummel here. I'm not sure what it does. I just got it. It's just like a... It doesn't do that much damage. Maybe it interrupts or something. Now, let's do the into the air stuff again here. Oh, I missed. There we go. He is. I missed again because I'm stupid. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to do that. Let's take this archer here because he's probably staying. Yeah. There we go. Oh, he died instantly. Shit. I miss a lot right now because I tried to show something off. Sorry, but... Um, I just fucking love the game. I mean, maybe I'm the only one. But if you guys are looking for a solo RPG kind of in this style, you should absolutely give it, give it a try. And this special thing about those pawns are, is that... Um, you can recruit new, young, new new ones, like Rook 2 here, for example, is my main paw. He will level with me, so he will always have the same level as I have. The problem with that is, the other two pawns will not level with me. So you need to, um, yeah, okay, now I attack, I'm doing it. Oh, just one shot it. He will just hold them for me and I can hit them. It's, it's. And one thing I want to show you, look at this. Wait, there are still some enemies somewhere, that's why the music is so so hype. No, okay, the music is gone. You can actually look at this. Why would you do that? You can just grab your friend and just throw him over like... What are those mechanics? I'm so overwhelmed by all the stuff you can do in this game. You can climb in this game. That's normally something you cannot really do in a game, right? You can climb. You can climb bosses. I would love to show that right now, but I'm not near a boss. So, uh, yeah, you can actually climb the boss... You can climb to its head and fight him from above. It's absolutely amazing. Your pawns will heal you. They give you some buffs. I have now a really nice distribution of classes. I have here the mage that can heal and do some fire spells. I have a strider, which is kind of a hunter. And I have a fighter here. That is kind of the same as... Well, I'm a warrior now, so two melees, um, which is absolutely cool. I want to show off my, my one skill real quick. The, I want to throw me into the air once more. 
Um. Oh. Wait, let's do it right now. There we go. Whoa! There we go. It's, it's, it's absolutely amazing. I love this game. And um, yeah, I plan on kind of finishing it. Let's see how it goes. I just throw two into the air. Yep, that's how we do it. Oh my, one of my, one of my pawns died. That's not good. You have to fix that. Let me just clear this shit real quick before I can revive my pawn again. Actually, we can do it right now. So if he dies, you can just revive him again. We can play this game on hard mode as well. So uh, I don't know how that works out. And knock him up. It's, so, it's, it's, it's fucking amazing. Sometimes if you knock him into the air, um, while he's in the air, your mage actually throws a fireball at him and he flies like even farther. It's absolutely crazy. Um, I love the combat in this game. And if I could see that, in, like I said, I want an MMORPG of this game. But um, yeah, for some reason, it's not in the West right now. Maybe it comes to the West at some point. I don't know how it is doing in Japan. Um, I, I have to do some research on this. Um, Wait, I hear something. What is going on? And fireball? Oh, almost, almost. Oh, nice. That are those are actually NPCs. So I don't know what exactly, whatever. Um, what exactly makes me play this game? Because I'm, like I said, I'm normally bored when it comes to MO to RPGs. Um, I just think that it's might. Because the combat really fits me. I really like the combat. Um, I, I'm just showing up off like two skills or something. But you can learn much more skills later on. You can swap your vocation, which is like your class, whenever you want to. Um, it's absolutely amazing. Look at this view. Maybe I'm the only one. But I just love this, this medieval mountain area. I don't know. And I haven't see, even seen anything. If you, if you want to see the map real quick, I'm right here. And I don't know how big the map is, but it's probably a little bit bigger. So, yeah. That's me. As usual, I did not put any points down. I was just talking over and just talking. Crossing some points. That's just me. But I just wanted to show you how amazing I think this game is. And I'm going to do some more videos when uh, on Pantheon. Because there was some new stuff that came out. A new stream. Um, but for now, that was it. And uh, like I said, if you like solo RPG games, give it a try. I'm pretty sure it's worth it. And uh, yeah, I hope to see you guys soon again. Let me know uh, if you saw some interesting stuff that would, or might uh, tell me something that you noticed. Um, tell me how you think the music is. The music that is running in the background is actually from this game. And this game has so many soundtracks. Look, I can climb here. So many cool soundtracks. And... Uh, yeah, let me know. There we go. NPCs can fall down. You can throw them off a cliff. I had a really cool thing that happened to me. There was a boss and he was way too strong for me, the boss. And people told me in the stream to run. Uh, what happened was he was falling off the cliff, the boss. Uh, and just died instantly. That was pretty fucking cool. So I'm having a blast. I hope you guys do too if you want to go and play this game. And uh, I hope to see you guys soon again. So, thanks for watching. Have a beautiful day. And as usual, peace.